Yes, yes, yes. I return. JJ, the Claymore Minotaur with another Elden Ring boss fight video. And you know who it is. It's the God Skin Duo. So pure jank, pure foolishness. But you know what I brought with me? I brought Rivers of Blood. I brought Corpse Piler. So it's over for these Ejects. Right. So. You can get them stuck on one of the broken pillars. And then hammer away with Corpse Pilot. Because that's what it's for. I don't even think I, I do regular attacks unless I run out of whatever the magic bar is in this game. Maybe. All of it is rendered irrelevant once you've got Corpse Pilot. There's another thing that you can add to your arsenal. But you know, we'll get there. We'll get there. Anyway, you take one down. You think you're done with that. And... You will later find out it is not so and they hit kind of hard as well so you've got to be careful the projectile attacks are pretty interesting this might be an explosion little bit of an aoe and they can do that projectile in tandem so you might think you have an opening to heal and they're just hitting you with a barrage of those projectiles it's it's pretty clever it's pretty clever but also a massive pain in the backside if you're underprepared fortunately you can make it so that you're only ever dealing with one of them at a time but you know you have to make sure you kite them in the right directions to do so and focus on one of them at a time and then you won't necessarily have to deal with two of them at once or if you do it won't be for very long now they share a health bar so be wary of that i understand they might have patched this what's happening right here out of the game i don't know i've not fought these guys since they may have done that so i don't know if that is a viable strategy any longer what I'm sure using the corpse pilot is. I wasn't joking when I did that speech when I beat Bloody Finger Akina. It's on. Oh, it's on. JJ the Claymore Minotaur, and I'm out.